Hello and welcome back to Fallout 3 with yours truly Lord of the the Mad. Hi Lord of Flows is hard with your thrifting level 22, boxes madman, kid is like 13. Oh god, someone closed the door behind me. And all around neutral guy. Ah let's fix my hair. Just a little bit brighter. Yes. Finished. Shit is bright out here. Alright, and now the DLC messages will come raining in. That's nice. Ah, scenic look. How pleasant. And the level up. The first thing I want to do, of course, is get explosives to 25, so... I could actually work explosives for the Megaton quest. I actually stepped close enough to the town to know that that is something I want to do. Actually, I could put 1.2 small guns as well because I initially need some of that. And of course, Swift Learner. Done. Now, if I remember correctly, there are ports of a new radio message behind broadcast, being broadcast across the capital wasteland. The transmission appears to be some sort of distress call and gives little information except the location and name of the man making the plea. Yeah, that's irrelevant. Seriously. A riverboat has docked at the mouth of the Potomac, carrying trade from the distant peninsula of Point Lookout. The captain offers passage to Point Lookout for any mercenary, treasure hunter or adventurer looking to explore the new land. This is kind of a mocky vehicle, isn't it? The top was opened, so you could sit in and... I admit, it's cool, but it's kind of wonky. Anything in the... here? A new radio broadcast has been heard across the capital wasteland. While completely un unintelligible, it sounds... ominous. Broken steel has been loaded, your level cap has been raised to 30, a new radio broadcast has been heard across the capital wasteland. It sounds like a distress call, but seems to be meant for certain years only. How fun. Alright, is that the last one? Also, the mothership Zeta one is kind of weird to get, because it cannot actually... As far as I know, it, I haven't actually got the Zeta.esm or ESP or whichever it is loaded. And I'm kind of amused that it's Elder Scrolls uh, thingy anyway. Because that's what they, they, those files used to mean anyway. Elder Scrolls Master, Elder Scrolls Plugin. Ah, very easy lock. Yeah, 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 I know how to do this. I played Skyrim. Honestly. I played Skyrim, trust me, you thingy. There we go, loot, loot, loot. Good loot. Can I use the swings? Or are they not actually with physics? Oh my god. I'm a witch. I must be. If a duck had been on the other side, I would be lighter than a witch. Uh, lighter than a duck, I mean. Was it here and how it was? Oh, we don't remember. Ooh, what's here? Ooh, nice. Let's put that on. Also, I'm not sure which classes actually are better looking, so let that be for now. Oh, yeah. Well, how else would you dress in this situation? Oh, a cellar Requires key, though. They do not have a key for the cellar door. How interesting. It does make you curious about where I could get such a key, though. Hmm. Now, choices, choices, choices. What do I do? I have left the vault. And I'm currently in the ruined town of Springvale. This, that's my understanding of the situation. And there's a 
You could call her. Thank you. Take call. Sure. Yo, uh, there are, there's also garbage. You kinda look like a hobo, so I might as well go here. Ah, uh, nothing. Such a shame. I was really hoping for some loot. Oh well. What else do we have? Oh, there's some more garbage over there. Maybe here we can find something actually usable. Nope. Right, let's check this house. Talk about gossip, shall we? Or more specific. Hello. Who the hell are you? Where'd you come from? Did Moriarty send you? Who is Moriarty? Colin Moriarty. The owner of Moriarty's saloon in Megaton. That sack of shit is convinced that I'm some crazy junkie who stole money from him. Slow down, then we are side of the story. Look, I used to work for that slob, doing, you know, favors for guys. Well, I got sick and tired of it. I told Moriarty I'm taking my share of the caps and leaving. I even slept with the pig to seal the deal. Next morning he tells me I couldn't leave. So I bolted. I took my money and ran. Now he's branded me a thief and a junkie and sent his cronies to find me. I guess I need a new hiding place. Alright. Keep your caps on until Moriarty you are gone. You do that for me? I can't believe it. You hardly even know me. Thanks, kid. You watch yourself out there. I don't know if you can betray him after that or not. Could be fun. Ah, uh, it's a capital wasteland. Does he have any garbage spins in his in her backyard? Does she even? As some of you know, might know, the Estonian language is without grammatical gender, so I keep messing those up occasionally. A locked cabinet. Let's see what's in it. Uh, this way then. Bobby pins and alcohol, of course. Not really interested in getting drunk right now. Need to record. No time for drinking. Would be silly to drink right now. Come on, what's in this? It's a letter from Moltec. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm thinking that. Data notes, 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 notes. Hold on, Jonas. I need to record this first. I. I don't really know how to tell you this. I hope you'll understand, but I know you might be angry. I thought about it for a long time, but in the end, I decided it was best for you not to know. So many things could have gone wrong, and there's really no telling how the Overseer will react when he finds out. It's best if he can blame everything on me. Obviously, you already know that I'm gone. It was something I needed to do. You're an adult now. You're ready to be on your own. Maybe someday things will change and we can see each other again. I can't tell you why I left or where I'm going. I don't want you to follow me. God knows life in the vault isn't perfect, but at least you'll be safe. Just knowing that will be enough to keep me going. Don't mean to rush you, Doc, but I'd feel better if we got this over with. Okay, go ahead. Goodbye. I love you. Greetings from Point Lookout. Straight from the land of warm beaches and luscious wetlands comes the Tasha's Gambit, the finest vessel on the east coast, piloted by Dober the Ferryman. And to the hungry masses of the capital wasteland, he brings the hearty punga fruit, a delicious and nutritious addition to your daily meal. Its tangy taste is the most refreshing meal in the world. Find the punga fruit at your local merchant now or buy straight from the source at the Tasha's Gambit, now docked south of the citadel. Special bonus. Hey, adventurers, itching to find Point Lookout's treasures for yourself? Talk with Tober to book passage back to this land of mystery. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Gomez, congratulations on your family's recent inclusion in the Vault 101 community. You will find outlined 
you will find outlined in your application materials a full review of rules and procedures related to the preparing for fa shelter in a Vortec facility. But we will outline a few key points here. Vortec provides all clothing, bedding and accommodations for residents. Personal belongings must be reviewed and approved of by an authorized Vortec Hermetics technician before such belongings can be delivered to your reserved quarters within the vault. In the event of an emergency entrance to the vault, no personal belongings will be permitted beyond the main door of the facility. All vault residents must attend an orientation seminar. If you did not attend such a seminar as part of the application process, you must make an appointment with your vault tech representative. In the event of a vault activation, whether actual or drill, vault tech will sound the siren audible in the immediate vicinity of the vault facility entrance and residents will be contacted via, via holiday message at the phone number provided in their residence profile records. Please report promptly to Ward 101 to await admittance and processing upon such a notification. Voltec looks forward to having you and your family as valued residents. Be sure to present this letter to your Voltec representative to receive your special commemorative Ward by Bobblehead toy. Sincerely, Voltec, Department of Public Relations, Washington DC. Can I mark this as red as well? I suppose I just did. Alright. Quests, quests, maps, stuff. What do I have in aid? Eh, mostly drugs. Drugs and nothing useful. I also have a coffee mug. Which I'm now just tossed away onto the ground. Because as previously mentioned, I don't drink coffee. Very often. Anyway. I certainly can't make coffee. Which I actually took a point to prove to my classmates on last week. So they're going to put it down in the yearbook for the funsies. Ha ha ha. It's going to be excellent. Alright. Um, what's What have we got here? Nothing. Nothing at all. I guess I could raid the school. Quick save! Excellent. Okay, so I probably want to be in first person for this. I don't particularly enjoy third person shooters. What's here? Nothing, it's empty. Of course it's empty. There's a motorcycle gas tank here though. That's cool. Oh, come on, fall over and die. Thank you, come again. So, 10 millimeter rounds and the Chinese pistol. And a hockey mask. I don't really see how that would be beneficial to me. Alright. What's that then? Oh, that one. Just a little bit more. Right, there we go. Oh, hello. Where did you go from? I'm just going to slap this over her head. Seriously. Alright. That's why we want to play. That's how we're gonna play. A pack of cigarettes, and that's something I worth selling. Nothing here. And nothing here. You'll think I would be wise enough to actually pay attention to the fact that it says it's empty. Nope. Never. Never. That would be silly talk. Extremely silly talk. And what do we have here? Point two. What is that in comparison to? So I don't know if it's millimeters or or centimeters or in meters it's probably not in meters <laughs> oh well maybe in decimeters or is it compa in comparison to an inch I know nothing of guns and ammunition nothing alright 
This staircase leads me up there. Ah, to an entrance to the Springfield. Was it Springfield? No, Springvale Elementary School. Too many Simpsons for me. Or too much even. Okay. I know that there are some lockers down here which might have something useful in them. Somewhere, uh, maybe. Maybe? Or maybe not. But there is a metal box with some darts. And toy cars. Are darts an actual ammunition that I can use for something? Does this game actually have drone weapons? Or is that just something I will ignore? It appears to be something I will ignore. Let's just sit on the bench. Like a bro. Oh, here's a locker with something in it. A baseball bat. No, that's beneficial because I can repair my other one then. Oh, what do we have here? A bottle cap, that's actually good. Which reminds me. I should actually get around to seeing if I can repair this baseball bat then. I can. Nice. This, I cannot repair this. That I cannot repair either. And I cannot repair my grenades, which sucks. I totally wanted to repair my grenades. Seemed like a wise option. Hmm. I suppose I should go inside the school then. Kick some of their asses. I'm not sure which entrance to take. Alright, I'm going in from here. Cover me while I kick these asses. Uh. This is gonna be fun. Plus fun. Your head exploded. All right. Hey, cut the shit. Who is that? Oh, I'm told to be Who's cautious. This is bullshit. Come out and fight. They don't know where you are. Ah, right, there you are. Oh, it's go time. It's really hard to aim at you, you know. I guess this is when this is necessary. I like how the charity was just like, uh, oh, whatever. Poor Q. That's probably not something that's necessary to me. Oh. Same story. Say goodbye to your eyes. That's actually not a thing in this game. Back in uh, the first Fallout, you could actually go ahead and uh, aim for people's eyes. It was fun. Ah, now I do need some of these old steam packs, I believe. Yeah, a lot better now. Could actually do with some sleep, but I fear I might still be in combat. Or combat, or whichever. Oh, this is where I am. Alright, that explains it. This is the floor where I kept dying. When I first tried this thing. Um, all right, I got the bottle. Hmm. But on the other hand, there is a safe room here where I can sleep, get some rest before I kill everyone else. Ah, what an ugly mole rat! What's in the fridge? Insta mash, gram, Milo cakes, squirrel stew, and sugar bombs. I'm not really feeling that hungry. Alright, what else do we have? Something in the oven? A pilot light, of course. That will... That might be useful to me at some later point, but I'm not going to... Feel concerned about it right now. At least I think it was the repair skill that uh, allowed for crafting weapons. 
crazy weapons at that. Like um, burning swords and the like. Uh. Alright, I hope there's no one actually around so I can grab a nap here. Ah, uh, nope. Someone's around. Oh well. Guess I must kill someone then. Let's see. They're not hiding in the toilet. This is bullshit. Come out and fight. Oh, I hear you. This is bullshit. Come out and fight. This is bullshit. Come out and fight. Hmm, not here. Just like a little bitch. I'm not scared. I just can't bloody find you, you bloody son of a bitch. Oh. Oh, nice. Anything here? No. Yeah. Hearing those damn noises again. Where this are you? Come out and fight. Are you on the second floor? I cannot see anyone here. Hmm. Ooh, carton of cigarettes. Nice. Scared. Costs five times as much, but only weighs four times as much. Interesting. Scared. Just like a little bitch. Yeah, I think he's upstairs. Oh, one's here. Bam, bam, bam. There we go. That's how you use a gun melee range because fuck aiming. I love this game for that. In the in New Vegas, I only used uh, melee weapons, so there I didn't actually get this pleasure. Yeah, I finished the whole game with melee weapons because I could. It was fun though. Why am I taking these items? I'm not actually going to use them anytime soon, am I? I suppose they actually have some sort of price tag attached to them, so I may be able to sell them. But for now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.